We've got live coverage from KZI 9 sports reporter Nick Orsini, who joins us from Pittsburgh at 2 o'clock in the morning in our coverage, sponsored by Kendall Subaru. Nick, thanks for staying up with us, man. Take us into some of the post game for Oregon. What was the mood? What were the emotions? What were the thoughts by this team after getting so close to the Sweet 16? I mean, that's the thing, Brett. You get so close, you have the opportunity in regulation to win it. You stave off a potential buzzer beater loss in the first overtime, and then you just get to second overtime, and your legs are tired. I mean, this is the second game in two days. Jermaine Kuznardin and Folly Dante were single handedly trying to will this team to the Sweet 16, and they get so close. But in the end, it just, Creighton just happens to be just a little bit better. They make a couple more shots, they have more depth, and that was something that. That Dana Altman was worried about. We got the opportunity to talk to Dana in Folly Dante. Didn't get the opportunity to talk to Jermaine Kuznard. He didn't want to talk at all, and I understand it. It's been a long day for him, but we did get the opportunity to catch up with some of the players on the impact of in Folly Dante and Jermaine Kuznard. I mean, he's the biggest competitor I've ever played with, and uh, he's, he's just a pure ho hooper, I would say. I grew a lot. I mean, just knowing the ups and downs really because I I really didn't really experience like lows really but this year I have and they just helped me through it I mean coaching me helped me on the court all the time know where I'm at still young trying to learn you know and they've just been there every step it means so much to this uh program you know uh, you know they kind of carried us all year you know they were uh, our leaders and you know they uh just bring so much uh, energy and heart to this team we're gonna miss them a lot Yeah, so Shellstad will be one of the guys that, you know, is going to come back. But look, in this day and age in college basketball, NIL, you never know who's going to be around, even regardless of how many years you've got left to play in college basketball. Look, Jermaine Kuznard and Folly Dante willed this team to a Pac-12 title. They willed this team to a round of 64 win, and they were this close to getting to the Sweet 16. But the journey ends here for the Ducks in the Steel City, and it ends here for me at about 2.25 local time a.m. But for now, reporting live for the last time in Pittsburgh with coverage sponsored by Kendall Subaru. I'm Nick Ursini, KEZI 9 Sports.